My name is Joel with Verses, a nonprofit committed to the memorization and meditation on scripture through song. The verse of the day is 1 Thessalonians 5.16, which says this, Rejoice always. Two simple short words and yet so hard to live out in real life. First, this call to rejoice, to enter into joy repeatedly again and again. But secondly, this other word, always, to rejoice always. Typically in our society, we associate rejoicing is when everything is going our way, when nothing is going wrong. And yet that's not what Paul says here. He says rejoice always in season where things are going your way, but also when things aren't going your way. And so how are we to do that? Well, we learn in the Bible that it's not our external circumstances that are our grounding place, that are our foundation, but rather it's our joy in God himself, that he is our true treasure, our true source of joy. And so we fight to see him as our treasure. It's helpful for me to remember that joy is a fruit of the Spirit, that this isn't something that I can fabricate or fake on my own, but rather it's a joy that I enter into, that I abide in God, and that He in turn grows His joy in me. So wherever you are, whatever season you're in, I want to encourage you to fight today to rejoice always.
hard to remember all of the joy yet to come. The hope that burns within us, the dark cannot destroy. With praise that's never 